Following a thumping against Arkansas, the UConn men's basketball team returned home against Columbia. What started as a blowout ended up an overtime thriller. It was a three-point shooting clinic in the opening half, with both teams combining for 29 attempts. Columbia took advantage of UConn's spotty perimeter defense, hitting 7 of 15 to quickly take control of the game, at one point leading by 15. For UConn, Christian Vitale didn't seem bothered by a shoulder injury, carrying the Huskies with 17 points, all of them from three-point range. His five threes in the half matched his season total. I was just playing out the game, and I was able to be in the right spot. I was fine that if I do flow in the game and I put myself in good spots, that I'm going to help the team regardless. So that's just how I was thinking. After half, UConn was able to get it together as all the pieces started working. The Huskies were carried by none other than the sharpshooter himself, Christian Vital, who came up clutch when they needed it the most. The team was helped along by strong finishes from Mamadou Diara and Jalen Adams, who closed it out in crunch time with 11 points each, including the game-tying floater. By the end, the start of the night, Vital sealed the deal with a steal on the ensuing Lions inbound. With that, the Huskies locked down a 77-73 victory. It started on the defensive end. Jay started playing defense. CV started playing defense because that's the only way we could get back in the game. We couldn't trade baskets with them. Um, we started getting stops. UConn will look to showcase a more consistent performance on Saturday against Monmouth in Hartford. From Gamble Pavilion, for UCTV Sports, I'm Ryan Kim.